60 years ago today, a 42 year old woman in Alabama took a stand by keeping her seat. It was on this bus that Rosa Parks was arrested when she didn't give up her seat for a white man. That was December 1st, 1955. Less than a week later, a young little known pastor named Martin Luther King Jr. led a citywide bus boycott. That chain of events set off what became the Civil Rights Movement and led to a historic Supreme Court ruling banning segregation. Democratic presidential candidate Hillary Clinton marked the 60th anniversary of the Montgomery bus boycott today at the historic Alabama church that the Reverend Martin Luther King Jr. pastored during the successful fight against bus segregation. Clinton spoke from the same pulpit at Dexter Avenue King Memorial Baptist Church where King preached his Sunday sermons as pastor of the church from 1954 to 1960. King's daughter Bernice King gave the benediction.